All right, everybody, welcome back to yet again another video. This looks really weird. I know. Uh, we're kind of up in the, uh, I went out west to my grandparents, so we're here for a little bit. Probably for the next week, some of our videos will be recorded here. So, just saying. Uh, but yeah, uh, we have a signing to talk about, and uh, I'm probably going to be wearing this jersey and my other All Star jersey a lot. But Nick Paul has signed a seven-year, $3.15 million extension with the Tampa Bay Lightning. When I saw this uh, this morning, uh, we knew that there was an extension coming. We saw reports that a deal was close. And I was like, all right, so Paul's been a great part of this Lightning playoff run uh, to the Cup Finals this year. And I think it only makes sense that they should give him some kind of a good contract. And was not expecting a seven-year deal. Was not expecting that at all. I think it's an all right contract. I think the AAV is right. If you made like the year length to maybe two and two, 3.1, I'd be fine with that. That's a good deal. But seven years? And I like Nick Paul. Don't get me wrong. I like Nick Paul. But when I saw this, when I saw the term, really surprised me. Uh, this is a really surprising deal. And I think that I mean, he's a great player, but I'm not sure if he's worth to stick around for seven years. It kind of reminds me of the Kakinami contract, which they're signing him to like an eight-year, $4.4 million, $4 million extension, uh, Hurricanes. Not the Hurricanes, not the Lightning, but still, it kind of reminds me of that deal. And this, this deal may come and bite them in the butt later, but <laughs> we shall see. But anyways, that'll do it for me. I have to actually hold my mic uh, now because I don't have a stand for it, but anyways... That'll do it for me. Thank you all for watching. For I support I really do appreciate it. Make sure to subscribe for new. And I will see you guys in the next video. Adios.